uh, Josh is showing us the C40 versus C60 on Commandante. Wow, that yeah. is uh, Commandante C60. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so, so I know you just got that one. So can you show, uh, can you compare with the C40 next to each other? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the C40. This is the most recent uh, yep. MK4. And yep. that's, so we're talking like 40 mil, well, 39, 39 mil okay. burrs versus 60. But I think the way they explain it is that the cone burr has increased in size, but the, uh, like the outer burr has increased in size, but the inner burr hasn't. So, uh, you know, how, however you take it, it is a much larger burr set, which I can show you now. Um, but otherwise, in terms of the actual body of the grinder, uh, pretty much everything else is to scale to like side by side. Side yeah. by side, the, th the thickness of the body. Oh, wow. Like it's identical. Yeah. Identical. I thought it's going to be the bigger. Highest. Yeah. This is way heavier. So this is full metal construction. You can see inside okay. there. You've got these Triton plastic supports. And there's okay. two lots of them, whereas on the C60, there's just like one right down the bottom, and it's all metal. Is that showing up okay? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, yep. Wow. Oh, wow. I see that. Yeah, it's quite heavy. Oh, quite goodness. Full on construction. Yes, the birds are much bigger, aren't they? The top birds. Oh, huge. Yeah, huge. absolutely. Uh, the other thing that's like most notable, I guess, by default. Is the handles the cranks? Uh, oh yes, yeah. Cranks are it's it's the extended Longer. one. Like yep. you can get these, you can get these already for the C40, but now it just comes default. Everything else out of the box is the same. Uh, that's probably the other biggest difference. Oh, so it's like a rather than the three spoke uh, grind change, it's like a full yep. metal, yeah, circle. So, so how do you change the grind setting? Same way, but uh, you're just clicking it by turning. Oh, no like kidding. This. Yeah, just like that. Okay. And, and it feels like the same sort of clicks as well. I don't see, well, I haven't counted them out yet. I haven't quite, I'm not ready up to doing a video on this yet. But no, I'm no, no worries. Sure. I'm pretty sure otherwise, honestly, I think it's a pretty well the similar clicks. Now, I've been brewing with it a whole bunch, though. It has a different flavor profile, um, and I'm happy to talk about that. Oh, yeah. I mean, that, I mean that's the one. So we are talking about less than 40 millimeter to go up to 60 millimeter, the conical birds. So they redesigned, obviously, they redesigned the birds, right? Yeah, I was so I was lucky enough. We just had the Melbourne International Coffee Expo yep. uh, last week, and I was lucky enough to talk to someone from uh, Commandante who were there, and they were saying, "Yeah, it's not as easy as just upscaling the nitro burr in the C40s." Right. Yep. So they had to redesign the uh, burr design altogether, uh, and there's a lot more surface area so a lot more cutting teeth a lot more surface yep. area to cut the birds uh, to cut the um coffee beans and what you notice is straight away how quick this grinder is to uh yep. get through a dose and there uh, which oh wow that so that is a pretty large oh yeah that's huge yeah i'll take the other one out just to compare but uh oh man that yeah that is a legit right that the 60 millimeter on hand grinder that's pretty impressive. That's a, that's a heavy burst set. Um, oh, wow. It's sweeter and, and a little cleaner, a little bit more clarity to, okay. the, um, to the C60. Then I always, I would always put the Commandante C40 in like, it's quite, it's quite well balanced, but it definitely kind of lends itself to a little bit more chocolatey, uh, full yep. body flavors. They're still round and juicy, but just more on that heavier side, not bright and clean. Whereas the C60 is kind of bringing it back into the middle a little bit more. So a little bit more fruitiness, a little bit more uh, sweetness involved. And there's yeah. a lot more uniform grind size though, right? I believe so. That would, yeah, I, you know, I would attribute what I'm tasting yep. to something like that, I would say, yeah. Exactly. You know, more, you know, more, uh, obviously more cutting surface, yep. which makes it less fine. There are still a couple of nuances that I would say are very Commandante-esque, yep. like uh, dialing in an espresso. I still this 
you can put the red clicks on this, but it's still like without the red clicks, you're still trying to find that right grind setting. Okay, uh, so how already, long take you to grind, let's say, 20 gram on C60? I haven't timed it, but uh, it is very quick. It, like, All that faster, quick. yeah, exactly. All that faster, right? Oh, a lot faster, yeah. Probably, I would almost say twice as fast. Twice, okay, that's good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, so I mean, that's... I mean, because as you know, with the, using the C40 on espresso, it takes forever. Yes, yes, but you don't even notice it. It's more, I would say on the C60, uh, it is more like one of the better easy presso grinders in yep. how quick it is to, like a J Max or something, and how quick yep. it is to grind espresso. So, so let me ask you, so when you talk to the people from Commandante, so why, I mean, what is their thought on bring out their new grinder? I never asked that. <laughs> oh, you never asked me that question, okay. No, but I will, like, here's my own opinion. I, yeah. Uh, I wasn't a big fan of the X25. Okay. Uh, I personally didn't feel like it was, like, the, the next best thing that Commandante could have brought right. out. But yeah. perhaps it's just our market as well. It just didn't, uh, I did feel like it didn't pick up. But the, I feel like the C60 is that thing we've all been waiting for. I know, because I mean, that is kind of like the next best thing, right? Because everybody, they're pushing the boundary. Okay. Yes. They're pushing, I mean, I mean, as we talk about, uh, you know, that's a 60 millimeter. I, I know you guys carry uh, Petro, the grinder, right. you know, that's the 58 millimeter flapper. Yeah. Yeah. So awesome. these hand grinders are getting larger and larger. So, I mean, I don't know what's next. By the way, so if you're joining us, uh, Josh is showing us the C40 versus C60 on Commandante. Wow, that is a yeah, huge it's a, it's a step up, isn't it? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Wow. I mean, that is like electric grinder, right? Right. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that, that feels and looks like something out of a Matsu grinder or something like that. I mean, even like Niche Zero, that's 63 millimeter conical. For it's not far off. It's not far off it. No, that's right there. That's close enough. Yeah. So what is the overall experience so far? I know you use it for a short time on C60. Are you enjoying it so far? Or? Yeah, I'm impressed by it. Yeah, I'm impressed okay, by impressed. the build quality, the the speed, the flavor. Yeah. It's it, it seems like it's not just bringing out, you know, the same Commandante, but a, a, a whole new experience with Commandante.